Hello, this is Joe Pearson, and this is a request for amendments to existing on-call consulting services contracts for the Community Development Department. Community Development has been utilizing professional on-call planning services in an effort to mitigate the ongoing staff shortages, extended processing timelines, a backlog of projects, and address legislative mandates. For the planning division, this is further exacerbated by an increase in the number of various types of permits due to staff, due to changes in state laws. While the long-term business model for community development is to continue to fill vacant positions and perform permit processing work in-house, there's been a persistent backlog due to staff shortages that will require the continued use of, on, of consulting on-call planning for the next few fiscal years. As of December 1st of 2023, there were four vacant planning division positions. Staff anticipates that the need for consulting on-call services will taper off as vacant positions are filled and new employees are trained. Contract planning staff through on-call agreements are primarily used for augmentation of planning staff for processing of development permits and longer range or policy related tasks and assist with interdepartmental projects and or developmental project management. The use of contract planners through on-call agreements allows planning the ability to respond quickly to these various types of work when full-time staff is not available. Over the past few years, contract planners have been utilized to work primarily on deposit-based permits, which may include environmental work. Deposit-based permits means the cost of the contract planner is 100% covered by the applicant. Some examples of projects that consultants have worked on are shown here on this slide. As a result of a competitive request for qualifications process in July 2021, the city entered into a contract with Rincon Consultants for on-call permit processing and planning services, including long-range planning efforts. Planning's use of contract planners has outpaced the current agreement with Rincon Consulting to the extent that the current agreement has been nearly fully encumbered as of November of 2023. Thus, an increase in the total amount is being sought. The Second Amendment includes a one-year extension and an increase to the agreement by $500,000. Similarly, as a result of the competitive process, in July of 2021, the city also entered into an agreement with CSG consultants for contract planners. Again, planning, planning's use of contract planners has outpaced the current agreement with CSG consultants to the extent that the current agreement has been nearly fully encumbered as of November of 2023. Thus, an increase to the total agreement amount is being sought. The first amendment includes a one-year extension and an increase to agreement by $250,000. In addition to the plan check backlog, the Community Development Department will begin the implementation of the new ERP software, which that will replace our current computer software starting in January of 2024. This effort will require additional planning consulting services from on-call consultants to offset the significant staff time the ERP implementation will require. We anticipate using all approved and available on-call contract services in this effort. There is no fiscal impact associated with this agenda item. Planning connects collects permit revenue, which helps to offset the contract expenses and their impact to the general fund. Additionally, grant funds have the potential to offset 
contract planning staff hours. Current budget appropriations are sufficient and available in the planning division's operating budget and various project accounts to fund these agreements. Therefore, staff recommends that Community Services, Public Safety, Housing and Development Committee recommend that the City Council approve and authorize the execution of a second amendment to the agreement with Rincon Consulting Services for on-call planning services, increasing the agreement amount by 500,000 for a total agreement amount of 1,750,000 and approve and authorize the execution of a first amendment to the agreement with CSG consultants for on-call contract planning services, increasing the amount by 250,000 for a total agreement amount of 500,000. 